As I look out across the room this morning, I see the future generation of the problem solvers of this great challenge. You're gonna be the innovators of the future. You see the possibility, not just the challenge. You won't let people tell you that something is not possible. I do have the great privilege to announce the winners of the Xylem Water Prize. Team India. We at Xylem, uh, we are so proud to be a sponsor of the ISO event this year. And the fact that it is focused on water and sustainability is, is kind of you know, right down our, our alley, so to speak. And what we really want to encourage and want to do is that those kids all over the world are looking into that scientific team because it's the most important challenge which we are going to face in the rest and in the future. We came up with this ID just to ask them to put in a video, make a one to three minutes video with the team of Water and Sustainability and how do they want to solve water in, in the future. Organic waste, solder or driller, a place to make home. Hi, I am Marianne. My advice to take care of water is to try to reuse water to create a better world. At the water source, the pump inlet pipe is placed in the water source. We find that one of the biggest obstacles and impediments to uh, helping solve the water issue is education and awareness. And the fact that these young kids and these teenagers are so excited about this cause. When I saw the videos they put together, I was just blown away. Uh, if I could capture that energy and that awareness and spread that across the planet, uh, we'd solve water tomorrow. Uh, and so that's what excites me the most. How do we handle the issues of uh, drinking water in many of the countries? And this was this gave an opportunity for the students to even understand why water is a problem, which is the most important uh, thing to see later how they can solve these issues. So it's a new experience. Netherlands is full of new experiences. <laughs> and I like the fact that it has so much to do with our the topic and our idea, so water and its sustainability. So all the three tests went good and although the results might uh, may not go in our way, it was truly a well-deserved trip for everyone over here, no matter whether they win a medal or not. The team that was winning was India and they made a video with a floating boat where you treat salty water into fresh water by the use of solar energy, so it's total package, which is really nice to see because there are a lot of things going on towards research recovery in the rest of the world as well. And everyone wants to be really energy efficient to treat the water, to make it more useful. And that was all combined in that video. Water is an incredibly emotional issue for people. And I think the kids, the teenagers, really capture the essence of that in their videos. And I just wish that my generation uh, had that same kind of passion and awareness. These teenagers are gonna change the world. I'm, I'm truly convinced of that. I think working at Xylem is really nice to do because we have a social investment program. It's more than creating economic value for our shareholders. It really is about creating social value uh, for the planet. I can't think of a better way to do that than to partner with these types of science competitions. Follow your passion. Don't let anyone tell you that something is not possible. Take risks, make mistakes, but just keep trying and just keep working at it and they're gonna be outstanding. Any one of them decide they wanna come work for Xylem, I'll hire all of them if that's what they wanna do. Hi.